Welcome everyone, Farmer Cop here. This is going to be the mod review for May 27th of 2021. If this is what you're looking for, please stay tuned. Alright folks, welcome to the mod review for May 27th of 2021. So not very many mods today and not uh, very many updates today. We only have two, so we'll go ahead and jump into it. If you're looking for a specific mod, down below in the YouTube slider bar, you should be able to skip ahead to whatever mod you are looking for. So without further ado, the updates for today, we had an update to Richport by White Bull Modding and an update to John Deere 8110-8410 by JA Modding. And that's it. That's all the updates for today. So we're going to go ahead and jump into the new mods for today. First up, we have the RYC120. This is by Raleigh Christie one VSR Modding Sir. 12.73 megabytes to download. This is for all platforms. If you're on console, this is going to run you 15 slots. It's just the trailer on the back there. This is found in the store. Let's go over to trailers down at the very end. Right here, the RYC120. This is 78,000 to buy, 120,000 liter capacity. And here is everything involved in that. So to hold all those items. So huge capacity, 120,000 liters, which is awesome. Um, for the cover, you can do standard uh, camouflage. So pretty cool. Uh, main color, you can change to anything on there. Design color, you can change to anything on there. And then rim color, you can change to anything on there. So you can kind of have a lot of customization options available. Uh, but there you go. That is the RYC one. So not very much money there. Um, I like the camo cover and to open the cover. I like the animation on that. F11, we'll go ahead and fill it up with, we'll say wheat for now. So obviously it's a ton of weight on there. We open the help menu there, left control I to unload here. Nice animation on the door and it doesn't tip back, which is, <laughs> that's great. That's fantastic. So um, I really like this. This is definitely a new trailer for me that I'm going to use a lot. So uh, yeah, the RYC 120. Next up, we have the Redlock 180 12.0 trailer. This is by 4D Modding, 15.55 megabytes to download, and this is for all platforms. If you are on console, this is going to run you seven slots. Found in the store, also under trailers, down at the very end here. Right here, the Redlock trailer, 18,500 to buy, 22,000 liters of these various crop types will fit into here. Now, one thing I'm going to test in a second, it says it has, a, well, let's look at rim color. You can change anything on there. Ooh, I like that. Uh, main color, you can change anything on there. Uh, grain configuration, then to go to sloped silage. I'm assuming that's not going to hold grain anymore, but we'll check in a second. A uh, sloped mesh door, that one's probably definitely not going to hold grain, but straight silage, straight mesh door. Um, so I went with this configuration, straight mesh door all the way up, I believe. Uh, straight silage might have been different, so I'm assuming it's not going to hold it, but we'll double check. Uh, under lizard, we have, we zoom in, oh, it's hard to get close on that one. Does not want me to get any closer. So there's your road tire. You have the FL 630s, the road agri tires, and the back to the road tires. Under Michelin, you have the cargo X bibs, the X bib HDs, uh, the FL 550s, and the balloon tires. And then we have the SHA2s, and then back to the cargo X bibs. And then knock in, we have the TRY2s. And then trailer board, we have the T404s, uh, twin forestry, twin radial, and then back to the T404s, and then back to lizard. Design, we have standard, uh, standard plus grass. I'm not sure why they need that there. Uh, add rope hooks, which I don't know where those are. Those might be on the side there. It's probably those things. Yep, add rope hooks to those guys along the side. Um, rope hooks and grass. Add air tank. I'm not sure where the air tank's at. Um, is it that thing up front? Yeah, right in there it looks like something changed. Maybe No, maybe it's just the loss of the grass there. Anyhow, air tank and grass, hooks, air tank, and you have various configurations through there. Uh, no registration. You have um, Ireland, lots of different Ireland ones that are there, <laughs> lots of them. Anyhow, lots of different stuff and some other ones from different countries in there as well. So um, yeah, tons of options in there for plates, it looks like. Uh, US plates as well, so all sorts of stuff. Anyhow, there you have it. We'll hop into this guy, we'll fill it up. Yeah, it looks like it's just gonna take chaff, wood chips, that sort of things, put wood chips in there. Open up the help menu, tip side back is left control I, control I. Ah. Well, oh, there it goes. That was delayed. That was really badly delayed. And there it goes again, but there you go. That is the Redlock 180.12. All right, next up we have the small wood trailer. This is by Kawa, 2.46 megabytes to download. This is for all platforms. This is four slots if you're on console. Found in the store under forestry equipment down at the very end. Wood trailer, $3,500 to buy. 
go into here we can adjust the colors if we want to rim color and all sorts of different colors there but there you go um, other than that it is a nice little trailer to hold logs for you it does have tension straps you can see three tension straps on the back there i'm looking at the back i don't see anything else that it's doing for you but other than that yeah if you little log trailer might be just a thing you're looking for so i'll have super strength on look at that anyhow there you go that is the small wood trailer Next up, we have the Lizard ULEP 3M Cultivator. This is by Poosecap and Sijon. This is 11.89 megabytes of download. This is for all platforms, and this is going to run you. Um, where's it at? It's on here. It's going to run you 14 slots. 14 slots on console. Holy smokes. And this is, again, not a one, not a two, but a three meter cultivator. So this is found in the store under cultivators at the very end. The ULEP 3M 3300 to buy, 90 horsepower required, 3 meter working with, 9 miles per hour. If we go into here, we can change the colors as we want on there, like the nice earthy tone colors there. Uh, warning signs, yes or no, old, new, with rubber cover, and back to old. So I did the rubber cover because I thought that looked the nicest on the wheels there. But here we go, if we hop into it. I'm assuming if we drop this down, we will be able to cultivate. And yes, it does have another attacher on the back, so you could put a cedar on the back if you want. So as much as I make fun of three meter cultivators, this is probably one of the better ones that we've gotten, to be fair. So yeah, very cool. There you go. Three meter cultivator for you guys, the Lizard ULEP 3M. Next up, we have the Polish Potato Box by Jelinek. This is 0.63 megabytes to download for all platforms. This is going to run you two slots in console, found in the store under big bags at the very end. Seed big bag, $500 to buy for 600 liters of potato. So it's not a bad thing to have. It's I would wish it would be cheaper. It doesn't seem like it's that really that good of a deal, to be fair. Um, it is a cool little box, I will say. Um, you can't lift it up, I don't think, unless you have super strength on. No, I don't think you can. Uh, but yeah, it's not It's not bad. It's, uh, yeah, it's, uh... well, there it is. There is the Polish potato box for you guys. If that's what you're looking for, you have it now. Next up in our final mod for the day is the two meter chain link fence. This is by Xblaze JEWX 0.39 megabytes to download for all platforms. Um, each thing in this pack is one slot. There are two things in this pack. There's a fence and a post. Under decoration at the very end, we have the two meter fence and we have the post. The fence is 500 to buy, dollar a day maintenance. The post is also a dollar a day maintenance, but only 100 to buy. So there you go. I have the fence up front here and then I have the post in the back. But that is all of our new mods for today, folks. Um, yeah, that's everything I have for you guys. If you guys enjoyed this, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button up on the screen to join the Farmer Cop channel. Turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.